Okay, Daryl, spinforamerica.com. This is upside down right now, but you can see these uprights right here. We have this argument, well, I shouldn't say argument, it's an argument with my little voice inside. Uh, I picked this thing up before he's got the uprights on it, and I looked at my box. The box says it's supposed to weigh 12 pounds, so I stood over here and I balanced them, and I thought, wow, it's pretty close. So that made this bottom rail thing here, this whole thing, it just made the bottom rail about 12 pounds because it felt about the same. Then I thought, what if Rubbermaid's way off on their weight scale? So I'm just ultra paranoid right now. But you can see how these two uprights right here is what we were talking about in earlier videos. That is where, uh, that is where the uh, wheels are going to mount. And these plates right here are where the hubs are going to mount to. So the axles to the hubs are going to go right inside the tub. So the side, well you can't see it now, the tub is sitting down. But and so that's what's going to happen. The axles will go right into the tub. Because that way we kept the, the distance, the outside uh, wheelbase on the, uh, uh, of the whole trailer really narrow. It's only supposed to, it should come out to about 27 inches wide which is perfect because then I can just roll this thing right into a motel and I don't have to worry about leaving it outside because it'll fit through a standard doorway. More later.